Hi traders! In today's video, I am going to talk about one of the most important topics when it comes to trading algorithm testing and it is Monte Carlo analysis. This topic is going to be the part of my trading course and if you are a regular um, watcher of my channel you already know that um, I started the algorithm testing optimization walk forward testing um, course and uh, there is already two parts uh, on the channel and Monte Carlo analysis is going to be a huge part of this course as well but in this video I am going to tell you the top key three factors that you can uh, get to know because of Monte Carlo analysis with the help of this powerful tool that you can use for individual um, trading algorithms, portfolios, um, portfolios in terms of uh, currency diversification, in terms of um, strategy diversification. And it is just a tool that you must use if you are testing, if you are coding, you are creating your own trading algorithms. Let's just start with Monte Carlo analysis. The first and absolutely key factor that you can that you can evaluate is the robustness of your strategy. As you as you know, if you are living on this planet, things are happening on a daily basis and every year there is a new huge impact that is happening in the world every kind of influential uh, situations and macro and global um, events that are happening these things really affect the markets and so you, when you are creating a, an algorithm, you have to evaluate how good is your algorithm and how robust it is to market changes. And actually, walk forward testing is not enough. I absolutely recommend for you to add Monte Carlo simulations, Monte Carlo analysis to your tool portfolio. What you don't know is what will be the order of the trades. So when you are analyzing a whole portfolio of currency pairs in an algorithm, you have to analyze what can happen if you change the orders of the trades. And this is one thing that Monte Carlo analysis is helping with so much because you can run like a um, 120 simulation test where you will be able to see what would happen in 120 different scenarios when you change the orders of the trades and some strategies are failing miserably like from from just a 10% drawdown and you change the order of the trades that it suddenly uh, becomes 50% drawdown just because of the order of the trades and it is exactly what you don't know what is going to be the order of the trades it is one of the key factors in stress testing because you can you, you can absolutely know the risk to reward ratios and 
every risk factor related to that, but you don't know the order. The second um, key factor is probability analysis. The probability of different outcomes. So, for example, what will be the probability based on all the outcomes, based on all the testing, that your drawdown is going to be the same as it was in the testing that you have done with your EA? What will be the probability that it will be like three times higher? Uh, or what will be the probability that it will be even lower? And what will be the probability that your profit will be like cut half or it will be double the amount? You will be able to know all these statistics and so you can have a much better understanding of your, of your strategy in different market conditions. So the third factor is stress testing, because Monte Carlo analysis is going to be able to evaluate your strategy, what it would do in very unexpected events when the world is going sideways. And it is happening every year, so you have to prepare for these factors because there is no peace and there is so much chaos in the years that are coming and so you have to really analyze your strategies with highly advanced stress testing methods so you will be able to know what your strategy would do in a really unexpected event like you could lose all your money with your strategy because when I just um, when I test strategies, um, for example, Martin Gas strategies and grid strategies, they show like from the original test, like a five percent drawdown, they can go up to one hundred percent drawdown based on Monte Carlo analysis. And compared to that, if you have a long term strategy a single trade entry strategy on a higher time frame you're like in the most unexpected event your drawdown will be like maximum the maximum two times or three times the one that you tested and the most important part is when you are testing your strategy with Monte Carlo analysis you are going to know where as a mechanic who is um, fixing something like you have a scanner for your algorithm for your strategy and you will be able to spot the weaknesses the strengths where you should tweak your strategy what are the areas it is uh, lacking uh, and it is very important because this way you can improve your strategy If you are interested in Monte Carlo analysis in more detail or if you are interested in just more videos like this about the topic, let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video.